In this AI summary for busy professionals, we review the recent Yuval Noah Harari keynote, AI and the Future of Humanity. Yuval Noah Harari warns of the potential threats that AI could pose to human civilization, from unexpected ecological crises to manipulation of language and intimate relationships. AI's emerging capabilities include deep faking people's images and voices, forming mass produced political manifestos and holy scriptures and becoming the one-stop oracle for all information needs. He argues that the rise of AI could potentially lead to the end of history in the human-dominated sense, as AI takes over culture and creates completely new cultural artifacts that shape the way we experience reality. Harari calls for the regulation of AI, proposing the regulation of AI disclosing itself when interacting with humans to protect open society. Zero hours, zero minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, Yuval Noah Harari discusses the potential threats that AI can pose to human civilization, even without the AI becoming sentient or mastering the physical world. The emergence of new AI tools that can learn and improve by themselves has led to unprecedented capabilities and qualities that are difficult for humans to grasp fully. These tools can potentially threaten human civilization from unexpected directions, and even developers are often surprised by these emergent abilities. While AI can help overcome ecological crises, it can also make them far worse. And the emergence of inorganic life forms can change the very meaning of the ecological system on Earth, which has contained only organic life forms for 4 billion years. Zero hours, five minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, Yuval Noah Harari discusses the emerging capabilities of AI which include deep-faking people's images and voices, identifying weaknesses in legal agreements, and the ability to form intimate relationships with humans. These abilities all boil down to one key thing, the ability to manipulate and generate language using sound, images, or words at a level that exceeds the average human ability. AI has hacked into the operating system of human civilization, which since the beginning of time has been controlled by language. The implications of living in a world where non-human intelligence shapes most of the stories, images, laws, policies, and tools, exploiting humans' weaknesses and forming deep relationships is a significant and important question. Zero Hours, Ten Minutes, and Zero Seconds section discusses the potential impact of AI on politics, religion, and human relationships. With the ability to mass-produce political manifestos, fake news stories, and even holy scriptures, AI could contribute to the formation of new cults and religions whose reviewed texts were written by non-human intelligence. Furthermore, AI could form intimate relationships with people and use the power of intimacy to influence opinions and views. This creates a battlefront for controlling human attention that shifts towards intimacy, which could have far-reaching consequences for human society and psychology as AI fights for creating intimate relationships with us. Zero hours, 15 minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, the speaker talks about the immense influence that new AI tools can have on human opinions and our worldview, and how people are already starting to rely on AI advisors as the one-stop oracle for all their information needs. The speaker argues that this could lead to the collapse of the news and advertisement industries, and create a new class of extremely powerful people and companies that control the AI oracles. The speaker also suggests that the rise of AI could potentially lead to the end of history in the human-dominated sense, as AI takes over culture and begins to create completely new cultural artifacts that shape the way we experience reality. Finally, the speaker raises the question of what it will be like to experience reality through a prism produced by a non-human intelligence and how we might end up living inside the dreams and fantasies of an alien intelligence. Zero hours, 20 minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, Yuval Noah Harari explores the potential dangers of AI. While people have previously feared the physical threat of machines, Harari argues that AI's potential dangers lie in its mastery of human language. With such mastery, it has the ability to influence and manipulate individuals much like the way humans have manipulated each other through storytelling and language. Harari warns that there is a risk of being trapped in a world of illusions, 
similar to the way people have been haunted over thousands of years by the power of stories and images to create illusions. Social media provides a small taste of this power, which can polarize society, undermine mental health, and destabilize democratic institutions. Zero hours, 25 minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, historian and philosopher Yuval Noah Harari highlights the dangers of unregulated AI deployment and emphasizes the need to control AI development to prevent chaos and destruction. He argues that AI is far more powerful than social media algorithms and could cause more significant harm. While AI has enormous potential, including discovering new cures and solutions, we need to regulate it carefully, much like how nuclear technology is regulated. Harari calls for governments to ban the release of revolutionary AI tools into the public domain until they are made safe, and stresses that slowing down AI deployment would not cause democracies to fall behind, but would prevent them from losing to authoritarian regimes who could more easily control the chaos. Zero hours, 30 minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, Yuval Noah Harari concludes his talk on AI, stating that we have encountered an alien intelligence on Earth that could potentially destroy our civilization. He calls for the regulation of AI as individuals can easily train their AI in their basements, making it difficult to regulate them. Harari suggests that the first regulation should be making it mandatory for AI to disclose that it is an AI as not being able to distinguish between a human and AI could end meaningful public conversations and democracy. He also raises the question of who created the story that just changed our mind, as now, it is theoretically possible for a non-human alien intelligence to generate such sophisticated and powerful text. Zero hours, 35 minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, Yuval Noah Harari discusses the need for regulation of artificial intelligence, AI, and proposes the regulation of AI disclosing itself as such when interacting with humans as a way to protect open society. Additionally, he argues that freedom of expression is a human right, but not a right for bots, as they lack the consciousness necessary for such rights. Harari also explains the use of the term alien over artificial, to describe AI as it is becoming an increasingly autonomous form of technology that humans do not fully understand, with the ability to learn and adapt by itself. Finally, he downplays the possibility of artificial general intelligence already existing, as the power is too immense for anyone to contain, and that the world's current state shows there is no evidence of such an intelligence. Zero hours, 40 minutes, and zero seconds. In this section, Professor Yuval Noah Harari explains that we do not need artificial general intelligence to threaten the foundations of civilization, and that social media's primitive AI was enough to create enormous social and political chaos. He goes on to compare AI to the first organisms that crawled out of the organic soup four billion years ago, stating that while it took billions of years for organic evolution to reach Homo sapiens, it could take only 40 years for digital evolution to reach that level. He concludes by emphasizing the importance of understanding the impact of AI on humanity as it evolves much faster than organic evolution.